to the next month. Why is there a Twitter logo flying by the volcano? You're back. Sing me a song. Huh? You still have something to say? That's funny. Oh, you're the best in the world. In this dark world, the air is always cold. Since creating you, I've never been alone. If you're tired, just lay down on me and sleep, okay? What was that? Seems like a long, long dream. I felt pretty good in the dream. That warmth is very familiar. The fuzz on the arms did not continue to spread. It hasn't been discovered yet. Still have to be careful. Huh, this note is... Seems like Magma has been working hard. Thank you, Magma Knight, for your contribution to the order in 842 of the Volcanic Calendar. Volcano Nights. Oh, we got some more horse milk. Yeah. The Volcano Sun. Handel Family Restaurants. Fresh cream of mushroom soup with vegetable quiche is available to all in Volcano Country. Crime rates rises in northern ports. The northern port has fallen into decline since the new ports were built in the south and treaties of commerce were signed with foreign federations to the south. There are now more criminal criminals in the area and the army will be increasing their efforts here so passers-by are advised to be careful. Seeking need assistance. I have lost two sacks of life-saving herbs in the forest. Wild animals attacked me and I had to abandon them. Help! I'm willing to reward a thousand gold to whoever finds them. Keith. Hmm, interesting. Let's read these letters. For my dear Magma, I'm not good at writing letters, but if I send you books, you better read them properly. I'll check up on you. Love, Rebecca. Ew, etiquette. Study for Plaza Water Fountain. Hmm. I'll read it carefully. It was fascinating meeting you. I wanted to send you a sack of books, but I thought you may be troubled by it. It's wonderful to know someone like you exists in this world, no matter how long you may exist for. Well, that was ominous. I'm looking forward to everything, including the changes. Lovely. Okay. It's fun to always keep improving ourselves. Okay, hello, Mama. Hi. Craft, hello. Hello, Mama. Are you here to see Magma? That's right, is she free right now? Magma! <laughs> Mana! I need you to do me a favor. Are you willing to help me? I can do it. All right, let's go. Welcome to Mana's tasting class. There's so many kinds of fruits. I haven't seen any of them before. These are all new ingredients that I've found in the forest recently. So how can I help, Mana? It's up to you to taste the fruit and tell me if you like them. I've tried them all myself, so don't worry about them being poisonous. If you try something you don't like, I've got water and milk here. It's nice to try so many kinds of fruit. Shall I start? Wait a minute, this one's still a bit dirty. I'll wash it again. Wait for me here. Mana's so caring. You are here, Magma? Your Highness! I was busy and came out for a walk. What are you doing here? Huh? Mana and I are going to try some fruit. Huh? Oh, Mana. May I join you? Oh, of course! Her Royal Highness knows Mana well, it seems. Ah, oh, she's too close. Her Royal Highness is actually sitting next to me. Mm. She sh she'll be back in a minute. I, I think Mana will say yes too. Oh, if it isn't Gwyneth, you've picked a good time to come. Oh. Let me try it too. Alright, you two both taste the same fruit and tell me how you feel about them together, okay? Mm. Yes! No problem. Try this first. Delicious. Very soft on the palate. <laughs> this is so sweet, I like it. I'll make a note. This is next. The red fruit. This... It's delicious. Ooh, so spicy. Milk, Mana! For you. 
<sighs> feel better. Well, let's move on. A moon-shaped purple fruit. It's not delicious, but it's okay. So bitter, so unpalatable. <laughs> There's still milk here, drink it. How about this one? I think it's okay. Green fruit. It's a little too tough, but there's a nice aftertaste. Wow, this one is also so bad. Is it because I'm a picky eater? It doesn't look nice at all. Everything Mana suggested is gross. Just pretend it's delicious. Oh, this tastes good. <laughs> good. You will try the blue fruit. Like her royal highness, I think it's super delicious. Good, I'll make a note of that. This is very sweet, I like it. Ah, oh, good. It's alright, not a bad taste. This is Magma, this is going to backfire on you so badly. She's going to like make a fruit salad out of all of these fruits you don't actually like, but are just saying we're good. Alright, good. Great, I've got them all. Thank you for your cooperation. There's still some fruits left, you can have them. I'll pack them up. Uh, if I get the ones that I think are gross, maybe Papa will like them. I'll take it then, Mona. Of course, my princess. Alright, this is yours, Magma. Thank you, Mana. Actually, I like all of these. Could she tell? She saw through the lies and the deception. I'm back. Happy autumn, Papa. And to you, Lee. The leaves are turning golden. Isn't it beautiful? Happy autumn, miss. How beautiful. It was a little cold last night, Papa. You didn't catch a cold, did you? No, did you feel cold? Do you want to light a fire? I have a lovely quilt. It's super warm. Sometimes it's even too warm. I told you there was too much duck down stuffing. I'm sorry. It's better to be too warm than too cold, at least. I won't catch anything. You're always so positive. Oh, we can upgrade. Ah, yes, we got the basic bow. Hooray. Good stuff. Completing them one by one. Keep up the good work, girly. Ahem. Magma, congrats on becoming an official knight. The Golden Knight Badge. Nice, a hundred reputation too. Thank you, Lord Les Lepsa. Okay. Next up is the advanced stuff. Oh, we've already in in completed some of this. Think, simply, intelligence reached 500. Awesome. Interpreted swordsmanship. Huzzah. You'll become an intermediate rider in no time. Or it will become an advanced rider in no time. <laughs> Lips is my best friend. I thought it was your, your other friend. How's my grade? My grade is terrible. How do I become brave? I don't know. Hey, Mars. I've never dared to own you. So please, don't hide your beauty away from me. Your believer, Gideon. We'll reply, I guess. Alright, what do we do? Extra masterclasses? We could enroll in an additional practice class. So, wait, hold on. So, okay, so we're already doing the wind curve shop, right? Maybe, like this is. Relationship research. Could he use this, honestly? Okay. Um. Choose a map. Let's just start off by going to the Forgotten Valley. I think it's time for some combat. Oh, we got an earthworm. Hello, Ippo. Too much decoration gets on my nerves. Kenneth, my man. Autumn has come. Let's chat. Autumn, golden leaf for you. Your hair, golden. Oh, thank you. What a lovely leaf. In fact, here, I'll, I'll give you a gift as well. Here's a golden orchid. Thank you for giving me a gift. We got a hunter. Hello. Autumn's here. If only animals were as abundant as the wheat crop. <laughs> This way, being a hunter, I only feel at ease when I see the animals alive and kicking. Let's explore. 
So what are Mana's abilities? So see, she's got the Sword of Obsidian. 75 attack, 11 defense, 28 dodge, 24 crit. She's got the Dance of Chaotic Swords. Hmm. Maybe we could make it a girls' night. Girls' night! Nina plus Mana. Boom. Yeah, I think this seems reasonable. How do we get more teammates? Add ones. Alright. Uh, we're going to the Holy Light Valley. Let's start. Alright, crew. Alright, let's see just how... Let's deal 37 points of damage to enemy... To three enemies. Okay. Interesting. That's interesting. It uses three energy? Or no, okay, it uses three now. Let's do a curve shot. Uh, let's take down... You're gonna attack Mono already? I'll take down this guy. Okay. Uh, you, you missed. Okay. And this guy's gonna be enhancing... All right, let's just use the Radiance of God. Boom. And a little raid. Nicely done, nicely done. You're attacking Nina. She'll be fine, hopefully. You missed. You missed, ya fool. Okay, okay, that's some decent damage. Don't really have a need to heal. We'll just end the turn. Man, these guys cannot hit to save their lives. Radiance of God, incoming. Raid, incoming. Let's finish off with uh, a curve shot. I should have healed first. We'll take all that. All right, let's go to the Golden Road. You notice the cliffs are dotted with strange statues. Could this be the remains of an ancient civilization? We shall record it. The environment here made you uneasy, and you struggled to concentrate. You had to leave. Let's advance. Red walking birds. Okay, we'll start by healing up magma. And let's do the dance of chaotic swords. Deals 37 points of damage to, end to three to enemies three times at random. Okay. I can uh, I wish the raid would finish you off. Okay, no damage. Okay, we got two targeting magma. Can I kill with the radiance of God? Not quite. Okay, because magma can't survive that. We could just make the... To, we could do a defense. And I think that would get them to not kill magma. Yeah, I think that's the play here. Okay, all right. Now we can raid, kill you, for free. Use the Radiance of God on... Let's go for this one. And we'll end the turn. Dance of Chaotic Swords. R really? Curve shot. Uh... There we go. Okay, might as well get a heal in. And then we can raid you. Giant egg. Okay. Moving on. A sunset owl. Don't really need to heal. We could start off with the Radiance of God. Sure, Radiance of God plus a raid. Okay, definitely want to heal. Uh, and I guess we could either curve shots or we could do the. This is more damage in total, so we'll do the Dance of Chaotic Swords. Okay. So you're attacking Mana. That's fine. That's fine. Can we. 
cross arrow this guy, I guess. And we'll raid you. Let's heal. And we'll do the Dance of Chaotic Swords, because it's fun. Okay. Radiance of God. And a raid. Okay, we gotta heal. We'll finish him off. Okay. Health is not the best right now. Let's take the golden road. On a small raised platform, you find a dusty lamp base. You take it. The small raised platform is covered with traps, but you still get the strange lamp holder. Lose 50% of your life, receive a marigold lamp. Okay. Okay. We gotta start by healing. That is the wrong person! Okay, in that case, um... Well, God. Because Magma's health is basically exactly 20. I mean, we gotta use defense here. And I guess we'll get started on this one. Okay. I wish I had, like, more healing abilities. What if... It'd be cool if Magma could get a healing ability. Not sure if that's in the cards or not, though. You're attacking Magma again? Why would you do that? Okay, so that means we gotta spend one on defense again. Which is fine, I guess. 67 day. I guess we'll do the Dance of Chaotic Swords. Ugh! Okay, luckily no one's attacking Magma. We can heal Magma and do a curve shot. But let's try to eliminate one of these guys. Okay. So you're attacking Nina for 29, you're attacking Magma for 29. We can take both of those. That's fine. We use the Radiance of God. We'll go with this one. I know in theory, you know, attacking one is, you know, more efficient. But he's got the defense. 14 on Nina, 29 on Magma. Ah. Can I kill any of them this round? I could kill... Oh, you're attacking Mana. But Nina still dies in this case. Okay, it's fine, though, if Nina heals herself. Okay. We're fine, then. We're fine. Let's use the curve shot on this. Okay. Attacking Nina for 29, we can survive that. Perfectly fine. Okay, heal. I was expecting a self heal there, but it's fine. Uh, curve shots. Okay. I think we just heal in spite of the cost, because you're, you're defending anyway. Radiance of God. Man, having a healer is, like, so essential in this. Like, supremely essential. Just one guy? Really? Okay, we'll start with some healing. We'll raid ya. We'll dance of chaotic swords ya. It's great. You're attacking Nina? How dare you? Radiance of God. Boom. Okay. We heal. We dance of swords. Oh, and we win. We'll take the blue road. You're healing for 179. That's annoying. Well, I guess there's not really much debt unless we can deal more than 179 damage in a single turn. Not really much. Let's just heal and just prep ourselves, I guess, and save our action points. And right, now you're attacking Nina. Great. Use the Radiance of God. A curve. Sh well, actually, we can, yeah, we'll do the Chaotic Blades and a Raid. You missed. You fool. More Radiance of God.
You missed. Don't even need to heal. Awesome. Things are going very smoothly thus far. Okay. I don't need to heal off out of the gate. Uh, let's just start off with the Radiance of God. And a raid. You missed. Let's do another Radiance of God. And some more Radiance of God. And a raid. Red one. Heal plus Dance of Chaotic Swords. Okay. Let us advance. Uh, I mean, this is probably going to play out basically the same. Boom. Boom. More Radiance of God. And these guys don't stand a chance. And of course, I'm sure the boss is going to, like, wipe the floor with us. This pond seems almost bottomless. Algae has dyed the water green. A fishy smell rises from the surface. It seems the water is probably toxic. Let's fish. Now nah, let's get out of here. This thing won't help, so you decide to leave as soon as possible. We don't need to sabotage ourselves. A grave digger. Well, have you tried digging? Oh, hold on. Uh, well, we should probably start with the heal. And we can raid you. And dance of swords you. Radiance of God. One day I'll be able to become an adult on my own, right? Yeah, I guess. Let's advance. Oh, we're almost at the boss. Hooray. Another grave digger. I guess we'll start with a heal, some chaotic swords, a raid. You missed, you fool. Radiance of God. Healing plus chaotic blades. Ooh, another Marigold Light. Let's take the blue road. We'll open the treasure chest. We obtained a Starfire Defense Scroll. We will leave. All right. Boss fight time. And I think Radiance of God is still by far our best damage dealing uh there is an argument for doing cross arrow we'll do that. we can do that next round we'll do the radiance of god for now because the weakness doesn't stack anyway there's no reason not to raid whenever we have the opportunity 64 to mana mana can take it but we will do the cross arrow and that reduces that by you know, a decent margin Okay, now we're going to a heal. Plus, so this is going to do 37 times 3 compared to just a straight 67. So we'll do, yeah, swords and a raid. 30 damage to everyone, that sucks. Okay. 30 to mana, that's fine. We'll live with it. Uh, you're weak for one more round. We should do cross arrows to keep that up. Because that is extremely important. Alright, now you're doing 30 to magma. We, we need to heal whenever we have the chance, more or less. Forty-eight to magma. Ah! That's, that doesn't work. Um, is there any way out? I, I mean, even if we cut that down, it becomes like 24. Uh, huh. Like, I'm pretty sure the weakness doesn't stack. <sighs> Ugh. And the way I see it, because if we reduce the damage by 50%, that's still 24 damage. That still kills Magma. So we're just betting on a dodge anyway, so we might as well just attack. 
Yeah, at least we got a crit. Ah! Yeesh. Eventually we'll beat that guy. Not a bad result. Let's keep trying. The forest is wonderful. Beautiful scenery. Man, I'm upset. <laughs> you know, that's the thing that annoys me the most about, like, you know, traditional turn-based RPGs. And I'm not even sure how you can avoid it in the design. But, like... It annoys me how brain-dead simple all the regular enemies are. And then you get to the boss, and it's just, like... Like, there doesn't seem to be a way to balance an RPG to where normal fights are engaging. But the... With the... Without, like, literally making the boss fights, like, impossible or something, you know? I don't know. Like, there doesn't seem to be a very interesting way to scale the difficulty. Anyways. Welcome to the family restaurant. We have new dishes for Autumn. Let's chat. There's a lot of new dishes for Autumn. You're really amazing. I love to make new dishes. You can use the same ingredients in different ways to create an infinite number of new interesting dishes. What makes me happy is seeing everyone happy while enjoying the food. <laughs> seeing you do what you love makes me happy too. Hey, Derek. Uh, mind if I listen to a story? If the restaurant didn't have Derek's stories, maybe it wouldn't be as busy as it is now. Can I get another story? How you doing, Derek? In order to hear more stories, I often invite people to dinner. Let's chat. If etiquette conceals true friendship, then manner should be discarded. Mana is the most beautiful when she wears a sarong. Her smile is always accompanied by a hint of sadness. She sheds tears when she is happy, and her weakness is like a crack in a bottle of beautiful wine. Those who pass by can't help but be enchanted. Okay, and then we got a noble maiden over here. Hello. I don't know if it's because of the changing of the seasons, but I'm feeling sentimental lately. I've had several love affairs in the past that ended in tears. When will I meet a person who will make me happy again? I don't know. Figure it out. I'm gonna relax at home. Have a little sleep. I don't have any classes today, so why don't I sneak in a little more sleep? Do some reading. Okay. To the lake. Tree stumps. Hello. You just took a break. It's a good place for us news, right? I see you're practicing swordsmanship and footwork recently. I prefer using spears, but I can help you practice. Let's chat. My mind doesn't want to think about deep things. But I think you're pretty smart. You have your own way of thinking about many things. Well, I do a lot of things just by intuition, and when it comes to serious discussions or theories, I don't really understand them at all. Can I challenge you? Propose a debate. A win rate of 5%. Yeah, I guess we can try. Let's debate art! What debate shall you I choose? The mind, in a hurry, add temporary mind. Dissemination of ideas, add temporary knowledge. self encourage add temporary dialect. What ma- well... What mind? Okay. Debate begins. Mind versus mind. Uh, uh. <gasps> Migrant won a portion of the debate! That's knowledge versus knowledge. Uh. Uh. Okay. Dialectic. It's gonna go to Hackett, I'm pretty sure. Uh. Actually, won! I know, I'm sorry. I'm surprised too. Dang it, Hackett. Craig. Sound of fish, sound of flowers, sound of running water, sound of autumn. Let's chat. Lake has a rich layer of sound. There are many groups of small animals that live and create their own music here. 
<laughs> you look so cute when you smile. Hey, Craig. Debate me, bro. Uh -huh. We're gonna debate uh, archery. But you know nothing about archery. Okay, we are going to. Yeah, we're we're doomed. Uh, I'll boost my knowledge, I guess. It's not gonna help. Man, how are these guys so much more like smart than me? gonna wipe the floor with me ah you're pretty good at expressing yourself Benson the autumn world is actually very suitable for painting the withering of life brings people sadness even the hand holding the pen feels heavier they're chatting the autumn world has a bleak beauty the wind is colder than in summer but there seems to be a sense of wheat carried on the wind, which makes people feel warm inside. Mm. Seems that autumn is a complicated season. Well, the forest withers in autumn, but we also have a, bum a bumper harvest. It seems that humans in the forest are natural rivals. Wheat will only be harvested once in its lifetime, and the harvest marks the end of its life. True. Speaking of which, I just got a fairy carrot. That's how good I am. Hey, Benson, come debate me. Hmm. You know what? Never mind. Never mind. I'm going to cook some eggs. A giant omelet. Something smells delicious. I'm really good at cooking. Eating is my favorite thing in the world. I'm also going to eat... Er, get some fairy carrots. Noki. We'll eat it now. What a nice smell. You seem to be good at cooking. We'll receive this gift. Okay. I need more strength. I've been rowing then the view from the lake is pretty good, right? To the altar. Hello, civilian man. I like to come to the altar. I often get some free food here. The bishop is very good at managing the various properties under the church, so we always have no shortage of food to eat, which is really reassuring. Hello, oh, sister. May we all live a peaceful life. Let us chat. It is so hard to maintain long-lasting peace, but so easy to break it. That is the power of evil. Hey, sister. You wanna debate me? I could, I could win a debate about archery. What debate strategy will you choose? Okay. I think the only way I've got even a chance at winning this is if I add temporary dialectic. Which is probably still not going to be enough, but it's okay. We will definitely wipe the floor in the knowledge section. But... The dialect is where we're going to falter, I'm pretty sure. Ugh. I'm grateful for the blessing of the goddess. Man, I am terrible at debating. Hey, Nia. You seem to be in a good mood. Did something good happen? No, I've lost three debates in a row today. Hello, Magma. How nice to see you in autumn. There's not much going on at the altar right now. Want to come and have a divination? Mm -hmm. Wow, your divination tools at the altar are so much more professional than before. Yes, it's all about getting the most accurate divination results. The more professional the tools, the more clearly they can convey the will of the goddess. I hope everyone can know where the happiness lies through divination. That's its, that's its true meaning. <laughs> You've always been willing to bless others. Hello, a wise man. Mm. The goddess is everywhere. Let's chat. It is not difficult for us to live in harmony with each other. Guidance. Okay. I would like to learn how to craft better, better leather. But I would also like to categorize and name animals and plants. And 
study etiquette for the water fountain plaza and St. Elmo's Legends. And... Some knight's swordsmanship. Okay. That's a lot of stuff. Have you sought guidance from a bishop? Have you found the secret to improving your grades? Okay. Yes, I have. Thanks for noticing, Nina. We'll go to the abandoned hob.